My first experience of Jenlek was Donald Fagan. <laughs> we bought this 1031 with a subwoofer and uh, suddenly I hear all details that I haven't heard before. I'm Lars Nilsson, the owner of uh, Nilento Studio. And we have been here in Colrid, uh, Gothenburg, uh, like 30 years now. We do acoustic, jazz orchestras, classical orchestras, a lot of uh, mixing and edit from location recording we do with symphony orchestra and so on. The monitor system in the main studio, the Atmos setup, is um, 8341A. The ceiling layer is also Genlec, and I have the same speakers because I, I want uh, the same SPL and same uh, power from it. Then my uh, subwoofer is 7370, and uh, it's just one of it. I put both subwoofer and the LFE down to that. You can also choose to have two, but it was enough with one. My studio setup is uh, Pro Tools. MTRX, uh, the new interface with a lot of inputs and outputs. I have leave the big control surface because I see that I work a lot with the screen direct. I'm more precise with the mouse without faders. So we have S1 now. So I leave the S6 because it don't take so much space. The GLM software is why I changed to once. Even if I rebuild my control room four times. So it's like half dB wrong in some small frequencies. It was a dream when I can adjust this small stuff because after four rebuilding, uh, you can't come so near as you do with the GLM software. And especially with the face with the, with the subwoofer. Now I can place the subwoofer just under me and change the face so it fits perfect with the main speakers. My name is Alex Shulga and uh, I'm music producer and Dolby Atmos mixer. I started my project uh, with uh, audio journeys uh, in uh, multi-channel surround sound uh, back in days in, in Ukraine and we uh, did it in 5.1 and then we uh, just heard about Dolby Atmos and we started to experiment. I'm creating some kind of uh, audio experience that uh, people are invited to take part in total darkness within a multi-channel audio setup. People close their eyes and experience uh, a journey that uh, like about 45 uh, minutes about maybe 70 or 80 percent of our attention goes to visual aspect when you close your eyes everything starts to perceive sound and sound takes you to another dimension that that is what i do when i came here uh, and uh, we started to collaborate on this and now we have lots of plans since one year we have now mixed like 25 production in Atmos and I will never go back because this is what I have searched for in 30 years.